Hey guys, welcome to another Gaging Gadgets Twitch tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can easily stream mobile gameplay, so any games you're playing on your phone, to Twitch. So the first thing you're going to need to do is go to your app store and install the Streamlabs app. I'll have links in the description, so if you get lost, check down there. I'll also have a detailed write-up showing you how to do this. So go ahead and install the Streamlabs app. Once you open the Streamlabs app, you're going to need to log into your account. So we'll be streaming to Twitch, so we'll go ahead and log into our Twitch account. Once you log in, in order for Streamlabs to be able to actually stream on your Twitch account, you'll have to give it access. So you just want to scroll down to the bottom and select Authorize. Now they do have some widgets built into the app, but I'm going to skip that because we'll be mostly focusing on how to actually just stream your mobile gameplay in this tutorial. So check the description, I'll have other tutorials covering these widgets and how to use them. So I'm going to go ahead and select Next. Now we just need to enable some permissions so that the app has access to our camera and microphone. So I'm just going to select Enable and then allow it to have access to those two things. The next step in setting up the Streamlabs app is optional. This is if you wanna be able to see your Twitch chat while you're gaming on your phone. So you have to give it permission to actually put it on the screen over the game. So all you need to do is select give permission and then hit this little toggle bar and then it will be able to do that. Once you're done, just select the back on the bottom and now we're in the Streamlabs app. So as you can see, it's got the camera. This would be more for an IRL stream. If we wanna stream our gameplay, so anything on the screen, we need to select this little button around the top right here that looks like an arrow pointing to the right. Then we need to just tell it to start now. So now that we've given the app access to record our screen, all we need to do is go up to the little gear right here, edit our stream info. So this is gonna be the title of the stream and then also the game that we'll be playing. Make sure you put the information in there correctly and then press okay. If you want to have your game audio captured, make sure that the volume on the phone is turned up and then this microphone down here in the bottom right is red. Now all we need to do to go live is to simply hit this red button in the bottom right, but I do recommend at least getting your game started so then you can just switch it over real quick. So I'll go ahead and do that right now. So I have PUBG starting up. Now I'm just going to go switch over to the Streamlabs app and then select the go live button in the bottom right and select stream games. It's going to ask me to update my Twitch info again when I already did that, so I'll select OK. And now it is live streaming. So now I can just switch back to PUBG. And all of this is being live streamed to Twitch. Now in order for this to work correctly, you actually have to have the volume turned up on your phone. So you want to make sure that the volume is turned up. That will force the sound to come through the speakers on your phone. So if you don't want that to be played out loud, I recommend using headphones, maybe Bluetooth headphones, something like that. And then just as an example here, so you can see what the chat looks like, see this little floating around Twitch symbol? If I select that, that'll bring up the Twitch chat overlay, so then I can see what's going on in my chat, and then I can respond to anything being said. So now that I have a game started, I'll show you a quick example of what it looks like in the browser on Twitch, so you can see what the gameplay looks like, and also how it sounds. So that's how you stream mobile games on Twitch using Streamlabs. If you have any questions about this, leave a comment below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you'd like to see more Twitch tutorials, check the links in the description. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up. And please consider subscribing to my channel, Gaging Gadgets. More gadget reviews and tech tutorials. Thank you so much for watching.